amazing to prank the prankster. Uh, and it's crazy because I still felt the same way because I, as when we're doing our proposals or our surprises, because I was. But Mike is like all chill because he doesn't know, he thinks we're just meeting a client. So I'm like running around trying to stay away from him because I know he'll see that I'm like in my mode. I'm in, I'm in my Matt and Mike mode. When I woke up this morning, I thought I was being dragged to some meeting that I really didn't want to go to because I was tired, but yeah, that was pretty much it. A meeting for a proposal. Man, we appreciate you coming, coming down here. So you had a, a flight delay? For sure, man. It was a little bit delayed, uh, but we made it. Yeah, that's uh, now. the things we go through for love, right? <laughs> yeah, this is something we are always excited to do to test the boundaries. And, you know, we're excited to hear your guys' story about, you know, uh, tell us about Stacy. Awesome. Oh, I love her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's that's where it starts, right? Excellent. So, do you have anything off the top that you're, you know, it, it, that you want to work in there? Well, tell us a little bit about the backstory of you guys outside of meeting at the Braves game. Well, Mike was asking some stuff we hadn't even went over. Like, what do I do for a living? Uh, what does my girlfriend do? Um, where does she live? How often am I? How often am I in Atlanta? Because I'm from South Florida. So, what do you do for a living? Uh, I'm in marketing. Yeah. Oh. So. Yeah, it makes sense. It makes sense. It makes sense. And what does she do? Uh, she is actually a server right now. Okay. So yeah. So, so she has a degree. She uh, for like a, she's paralegal. She has a paralegal degree. Okay. And stuff like that. Man, I feel like there's just so many options and directions. There is. I'm I'm excited, man. I'm really excited. I I love the fact that there's nothing off the table. You're open, and I think that's, that's, that's perfect for us. That is perfect. Yeah. yeah. Get crazy with it. We got kiss cam. Afraid of heights, not afraid to push the limit, willing to get arrested. Yeah. No felonies. Those no are the felonies. those are the ingredients. Misdemeanor, misdemeanor. Oh, down. So oh. those are all the ingredients of what we like to call an epic proposal. Okay. So I think we can definitely um, pull this off. Yeah. Pull this so, off. You ready to see the real? Let's do it. <laughs> this place is huge. Matt, Mike, I bet you're wondering how I'm sitting at the table with y'all right now that is and up here on this demo reel. While you thought I was bringing you here with a surprise proposal for my girlfriend, I've actually been brought here by someone to surprise one of you. And they're in the building right now. Where are they? What you? I'm so confused. Oh, it's on you. Antonio, help me out! Oh, what? Sorry, I was caught up in the moment. Yeah, I got you. Stadium. 
you. Actually, it was at Mike and London's birthday party, combined birthday party, and I'm sitting at the table, and Kim walks up to me and taps me. She's like, hey, can you come here and help me do something real quick? I was like, sure. I thought she was going to, like, get me to carry something. I walk yeah, I around the side, and she grabs me. She said, Matt, I'm pregnant. And I was like, what? And she was like, look, Mike always surprises people. He never gets surprised. I want to surprise him, and I need your help. So I was like, game on. <laughs> Not, oh my God, I, I can't believe, this is what I do, surprises, like this is my forte, and I had, ab I had absolutely no clue, so the fact that, I don't want to say I've ever set a standard or a bar when it comes to surprises, but to be able to get me and then make me work on my own, <laughs> surprise, like, oh that my. That was the best part. <laughs> Like, I put together a demo reel for, to surprise myself. Like, that's... Uh, man, I gotta ask you though, Mike, how does it feel to be on the other side of things? It's not usually that the getter got got and the prankster got pranked, but you should know better than anyone yourself that at Making the Movies Jealous Proposal Services and Michael Mueller Media, distraction is king. You don't know what's gonna happen until it happens. And that's exactly what, what took place here today. I don't, it's going to take a second to really just sink in because I'm just trying to get past how they pull it off. It hasn't even really sunk in that we're expecting. <laughs> I'm not even, I'm like, wow. That part hasn't really hit me yet. I'm still trying to figure out how, I, how the hell they did it. Kim did amazing. This was all, all on her. I couldn't have done it without her, of course. Yeah, it's been hard because I've been so sick and tired and I've just had to like, I just it's had all, to hide. It's all ringing. It's all going and, on. No. And the funny, the funniest part of the hiding is that uh, we are on keto diet together. And so my doctor said that I couldn't be on keto. And even if I wanted, even if I wanted to be on keto, I couldn't have because I was so sick. And so I just needed all the carbs, all the breads, all the crackers. So I've been closet eating <laughs> for like a month. <laughs> And I've been giving her how I'm like, all them carbs you're eating. Yes. She's like, whatever, I'm at my goal weight. I'm going to bring in carbs. And I'm like, I said, yeah, but you should have some control. Uh, congratulations, Mike. And you're an awesome dude. And when I do get married and propose, I will be coming to you guys. Mike, Kim, again, congrats. It is a huge blessing to have another child on the way. Uh, I mean, I got goosebumps. I feel like, man, it's it's awesome. Um, yeah. uh, I love y'all very much, and yeah, congrats, guys. I love you with all my heart. I wouldn't want to do this with anybody else.